around eight years back, I started a YouTube channel. At that time, it was not called Methogenius. The name of this channel was Smart. And the idea was that a random channel that made you smart. Today, I made really random videos like what happened on Earth in 60 seconds, taught magic tricks, DIY. I also made a video on like food aesthetics problem. After making like 40-50 videos there, I soon realized that I didn't have a good camera, nor the equipment, nor the backgrounds, nothing to make good looking videos. And due to that, I made very bad videos. Like, if those videos got into hands of some roasters, I would definitely have been roasted and would have been more famous than I am today. So then I thought, what is it that is needed, does not need fancy visuals, and is something I can do good. I was good at math, so I thought, let's start a math YouTube channel. So I was discussing with my sister, like, I need a channel name which made you smart at math. And after some thinking, she said, how about Mathogenius? And this was the point this channel Mathogenius was born. Around that time, this software called Videoscribe was famous to make these good looking whiteboard animation videos. So I thought, let's make my first video on this. How to become a genius in maths. In that video, I just talk about how to remove the fear of math. And guess what? It blew up. At that time, it got a lot of views. Like views like started to like rumble on it. And this is that peak of those views. And with these views, my channel got monetized. And I remember like I also got my first payment of around like 10,000 rupees. And this gave me enough motivation to keep going. For the next two to three years, like I just kept trying to make a video similar to that one. I tried many different things, but I couldn't replicate it, but how to become a genius in maths did. And in that time, I never showed my face. I thought showing my face decreased the quality of videos. But after making a lot of videos, I had got some experience of speaking, etc. So I thought, let's try again to show face. So I did a face reveal. And soon after that, this is the canon event, like I got my hands on a book called Secrets to Mental Math by Arthur Benjamin. I read that book and thought, why not make videos on this? So I made this video, how to calculate faster than a calculator based on some principles from that book. And guess what? It went super viral. Like it was the time I was entering my MSc, COVID was there and this video like went viral. The peak was insane, like this was the original peak. And this was the peak which I got from this video. So yeah, I was able to recreate the success of that original video. And then I just continued making videos on mental maths. And this channel, Method Genius, became one of the go-to channels if you want to learn mental maths. Now, why I'm telling you all this? Around three years back, I've joined my PhD in astrophysics. And recently, I also got a paper published. And when I shared that paper on this channel and on the LinkedIn which is connected to this channel, a lot of people asked like, what do you do in astrophysics? What are the things you do? etc etc and also a lot of regular subscribers keep asking like when the next video is going to come what are the updates etc and it's true also since i joined the phd i've been too slow at youtube so just to kill all these birds with a single video series i thought let's make mythogenous vlogs so in this video series i will share what's happening behind the scenes of this channel like what i'm currently working on why the videos are taking time what i'm doing in astrophysics all the interesting things i learn in research in this youtube and like random stuff which was initially the idea i will try to post these vlogs regularly maybe weekly so that you can be updated and be part of this really cool journey of Methogenius. So thanks for watching this episode of Methogenius Logs. See you in the next one.